Quarterback Angel Santiago ran for 120 yards and three touchdowns and threw for another score as Army defeated Morgan State 28-12 in the season opener here at Mikey Stadium. Santiago, who was named Army's starting quarterback one week ago, led the Black Knights on a 95-yard march on their first offensive series of the season. Angel capped it off with a 33-yard touchdown run on a fourth down and three. Santiago would add two more short touchdown runs and hit Siobhan Lawrence, who made a tremendous play on an 18-yard touchdown catch. One of those, the axioms that you, if you're going to have a season, you've got to win the opener, and, and so we fulfilled that, 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 that first condition of success, and, and, our, and we, we enjoy, we're enjoying that. We have an awful lot of respect for our opponent. Boy, they battled, they battled their tails off. Uh, Angel did some great stuff, and the best thing, again, the best thing about Angel's performance was the ball's not on the ground, um, and there were some chances for the ball to be on the ground. He took some shots. I just was coached up on that. And he, and that's, and that's, and the ball goes through his hands on every snap. So um, you know, that, that's, that's, again, that kind of play at quarterback will give you a, a great chance. There'll be all kinds of things he'll do better. C clearly he's, a, he's got quick feet and he can make some people miss and he can run and he made some nice throws. Now there's some throws he'd like back. We had the one punt blocked, but to play 60 minutes of football like that in the opener, and have no turnovers on either side of the ball is really remarkable. And if I'm not mistaken, I don't think we were penalized, which is again, that again, some of those things we we were trying to pick a fight about, signing things we were gonna we were gonna make a difference in with our preseason and our approach through the spring and summer. Um, you know, we validated something. Now that's that's just one time up. You know, but if you can, if you don't, if you're not penalized much and you don't turn the ball over, you're hard to beat. So with all all 11 guys, and you have to defend the quarterback's legs. And then, then he threw a couple of nice balls, and I, I, my, my comment to Pime is that's not fair. When you, can, when you can be that dangerous with the football in a power running type offense and, and then be able to throw the ball that well, that, that uh, accurately really stresses a defense's numbers. You know, you're in it. But, and as you'll notice that I, I was proud of the way the guys, the guys got through that game. And now we played a lot of guys, but it was a, it was a it was a tough night to be playing defense and chasing that quarterback, and it was a, and it, we played a lot of guys. We had a couple of guys cramp up, but I think as a unit we're gonna we're gonna feel good about where we are from a conditioning standpoint coming out of training camp. Nobody should be surprised by that. We're not. But Great to have a person win. Yeah. You know that you always want to start using a good note, and with the W we did that. Uh, I know on, on defense it was a little sloppy. Uh, some formations they kind of threw at us, so we had, we had to adjust on the go. Uh, but nonetheless, it's good to get that first one out the way. Perform. I, perform, I, I feel like I perform well. You know, there's there's much things that I need to improve on, and again, a lot of the success came from you know the receivers making big plays and the O line really doing the thing up front. So it made my job a lot easier. I mean, the turnover starts with these guys right here. I mean, they they were the ones who were holding on the ball and keeping it safe whenever they got pressure. They were you know five points of pressure on it, and the penalties. I think everyone was just really focused. Everyone had the mentality of kind of one play at a time, you know, and no one was looking too far ahead. Everyone was just kind of precise in the moment. I would say that we, uh, we as an offense, uh, in my eyes, we came out a little complacent. And uh, that's one thing that we cannot do. We need to come out, you know, just like it's the first half, you know, the scoreboard 0 0 in our eyes. So that's one thing that we definitely change and mitigate that happening from again. Uh, we felt great. We've done a lot of pass blocking during camp, um, a lot more than we did before. So we were really comfortable. And, you know, Morning State showed a lot of different looks, but everyone, you know, we knew our assignments very well against the different defenses. and. You know, pass pro for us felt pretty good, and when we give Angel plenty of time, I mean, he's going to connect with the guys like he did tonight. The victory is Army's first in a season opener since 2010. The Black Knights will be next in action next Saturday on the road at Ball State, a game you can listen to across the Army Sports Network. The final score from Mikey Stadium, Army 28, Morgan State 12. For Night Vision, I'm Rich DeMarco.